Have you ever asked yourself the following question? Where was my football mate? So answering the previous question, which I think most of you already know the answer of, most footballs are made in Pakistan, more precisely in the city of Sialkot, where every year 40 million footballs are made, and every four years 60 million footballs are made for a World Cup. In Pakistan, 20% of overall workers receive less than $1.25 a day. Working conditions and overall health are also a huge problem. Here is where fair trade comes in. The label assures a fair wage and a better lifestyle for those who produce your footballs. More precisely, a fair deal for workers, no child or bonded labor, fair rates of pay, safe working conditions, and access to union representation, and an extra 10% fair trade premium. The extra 10% fair trade premium gets invested in projects such as free eye and diabetes tests, free school books and backpacks for workers' kids, and free safe clean drinking water. The brand Balance Ball has brought three different types of balls on the market. A leisure ball, two training balls and a pro ball. The Bala Play is a great option if you want to play with it on a park or on a beach with friends. Although we played with it on artificial grass and the result was pretty remarkable. Julien enjoyed a couple of great free kicks as the flight was very durable and the quality offered was really great. Next comes the Bala Team. This ball's goal is to serve you as a training ball. He's among the most popular choices in schools and clubs. And yes, he looks like a pokeball. In our opinion, he's one of the best balls that we've played with because he has a very durable flight and is really good for curved straight shots. Although he has the same problems that most balls have, um, you have to hit him really hard for you to have a powerful shot. The Bala Astro was designed to play on the streets or on artificial grass. He's made with a special hard wearing surface and a latex blood for bounce. Um, he was the most popular choice for free kicks because his flight was very durable and every kind of technique could be used with it. Finally, we arrived to the Bala Pro. This is the top of the range ball as he was made with the same specs as FIFA approved balls. He skillfully hand stitched with four polyester backing layers and an 8 win latex bladder. He's of course the best ball that can be played with as the quality of its flight and of its touch is really remarkable. He's perfect for passes and shots. Every ball offered a great quality as they all had a stable flight. The knuckleball and curveball techniques were easy to use and the performance and durability of the four balls were also pretty remarkable. The touch and grip were more than satisfying, even if we had more difficulties with it than with an official Adidas ball. For us, the only inconvenience was the force that had to be used to really have a strong shot. But that was mostly due to an internal problem as they arrived with a low PU in winter. All our players were more than satisfied with the result of these balls and really appreciated play with them. Our 
already some clubs are playing with some of these balls in small and amateur leagues. And the reason is perfectly understandable, as their balls are really enjoyable and offer great quality. Their price is relatively low and the cost is also a big reason to consider playing with them. I can only recommend them for every player or team that wants great quality balls, combined with the fact that they are a help for workers in developing countries. As I hope that you enjoyed the video, I would be really glad to hear what you have to say about them in the comment section below. Thanks for watching and see you soon. Well, I rise above.